Hey, Kelly here from Cochrane Toyota. We're located at 8 River Heights Drive, Cochrane, Alberta. And today I've got a 2014 Tundra Limited to show you. All right, this is a great truck. You've got a Toyota certified used vehicle, which means that our technicians have gone, done a full mechanical safety, made sure all the Toyota required maintenance is done on the guy. And they do an exterior audit of the car to make sure it is up to Toyota's premium used car standards. And again, this Limited is, it comes really well equipped. The Barcelona Red is an awesome looking color. And again, when you take a peek at this thing, it is in really good shape. So it comes with the hitching wiring right from the bottom. And then when you open up the trunk of this guy, you do have your backup camera lockable piece right here. You look inside, it does actually have the, the spray and box liner right from Lionx here in Calgary. And again, you do have these um, pieces that will go right along the those little tracks there so you can fit them in and actually have mount. Then it's got the tri-fold um, uh, tonneau cover. So you get the hard tonneau and then you pop this guy right here and it does flip up there as well. I gotta pull that one there as well. I do that, can't do it one-handed. Pop that back up and again, overall really good shape. Take a peek at this guy. I mean, there's a reason why this thing was certified certified at uh, 100,000 K. Usually it doesn't quite get there um, as there's something usually missing with it. But this Barcelona Red is in great shape. Good set of tires on this guy as well with the 20 inch alloys. Running boards right from Toyota. Up front, you've got um, fog lights, the whole works. This has got a 5.7 liter V8. I'll jump in and show you that. So again, very good shape. Still purrs, these things will last a long, long time. 100K is just breaking in a Tundra. But again, great overall vehicle. Pop that down, that chrome in there, that's from the Limited. There is a little bit of a ding right there for you, but again, not too, too, too bad. Clean windshield, no scratches or, or chips or even pitting on this guy. So again, good looking set there. Of course, that five liter V8 right there for you. One of the things, especially with the Crew Max, is how big this back end is. The door wide is, is wide and long, so you can get lots of space in there. Take a peek at that. If you've not had a Tundra, these Crew Maxes are large. So again, inside here, you're gonna have the upgraded stereo as well. And then the interior is still in phenomenal shape. So take a peek at that. You've got a drop down here. It's a cup holders, and you'll notice you've got the third anchor. Same thing as back there and back here. So you get two triple um, harness um, child seats. You can easily fit the three of them across. The middle one, you'd need the seatbelt to go there. And then this guy's added in in headrest um, DVD. So both of those. Inside the glove box, we've got the headphones and the controllers for them. Again, a nice option, especially if you're toting around kids back there. Or heck, even myself would like to watch some DVDs as I'm going through. This guy's gonna have your blind spot monitor, so that thing will turn bright orange. You can see that little car right there. That'll turn bright orange if someone's back there, which is a nice option. And of course, you've got lots of little cool features in here. Nice and clean, simple. This era of the Tundras were just a great little vehicle. So power windows, power locks, and of course your lockout button to keep the jerks in the back from messing with your windows. Power seats, so you got lumbar right there, and then your back, and then your the bottom piece, where you can adjust accordingly. And again, take a peek at this thing. Even at 100,000 K, this thing is in phenomenal shape all the way through. You don't have to worry about any of that ripping of the seats or anything like that. So a nice option right here, you've got that back window. Um, I really like that because again, you with the sunroof and this back full window, the whole thing comes down. You get a really nice airflow without having to open up your sides. The blind spot monitor is again, a really nice function here. I'll turn this on, you can see it. So I press that button, you can see the bright orange. It's a nice touch. And if you hear that little click, that means it's actually going to stay there where some of the other buttons, you have, every time you turn it on, you have to actually uh, press that button every time you turn the key over. This is going to be for your, your headlights, for your towing, so you can aim where you want. So if you've got a load in the back, you can adjust where your headlights um, shine. So again, you're not blinding everybody on the road. I'll jump inside and show you a couple more of the options when I get in here. All right, it's so first thing when you get into these Tundras, full-size truck. I mean, they're just huge. They're awesome, awesome vehicle. Lots of space to see. And again, just overall a great sized vehicle um, once you get into a full-size truck it's hard to get back out of it um, they're just an amazing rig all around so first off right off the bat you're going to have your um, music settings right here so i can change the channels those kinds of details right from there volume control this side's going to be my bluetooth phone um, and voice command for the navigation whole works this is going to give me my center this one sorry the display is going to give me that center mode right there so I'm gonna pump in through, so fuel economy, this is as you go. Um, distance to empty, these ones still had the um, 80 liter tank in them, so again, they're not a huge tank, but again, it allows you not to have to put um, a lot of money in each tank there. So elapsed time, average speed is gonna tell you how fast the car was driven during the last trip. 
um, temperature outside. And again, settings, I can jump into here, hold this button. I can do turn by turn navigation. I can adjust the way that is. Language, I can adjust that unit. So miles per hour, those kinds of details. Um, and then I can exit it right here. So if I roll through this again, again, your um, average fuel and so on and so forth. So again, you can get used to that one really quickly. We'll jump in here. I like this. This has been around for a while where you can get a full size cell phone in there and it's a nice little ridge you can see back here. You don't have to worry about it sliding around all the way through. Underneath this guy, this bag is full of the headphones and controllers for those DVD entertainment systems back there. More storage in here. One of the things I like that Toyota does, if you look in the cup holders, there's no little spaces or gaps or anything for a coffee spill or a pop spill or anything to seep into and never ever get out again. So super easy to clean. Get another space right there for you. And then lots of little functions. So you got your gear up, gear down, right through here. I'll pop this out so you can see underneath here. You've got your USB and auxiliary out. That's going to hardwire right to your stereo. And of course, you've got two um, 12 volt battery or 12 volt charges there. Um, you've got your heated seats right here. Dual climate control all the way through, which is nice. So I turn the sink off and I can adjust however I'd like. Usually it's the other way around, cold here and hot here. I don't know about you guys, um, but then you can control it all the way there. Um, display, you've got your four wheel drive systems right here. You can turn this on the fly if you want to. The four wheel low, um, you have to be in a um, neutral to get it to four wheel low. The four wheel high, anything under 80K an hour, you're gonna be able to switch it on the fly. On this side, you got traction control, parking sensors, and of course, tow haul mode. Um, so you can change the shift points that you're gonna have for, for towing. So if I jump back into here and I go to the home screen, this is gonna give you your, your setup however you'd like. So right now, audio is off. Let's go to FM right there for you. And you can go to wherever you'd like. Um, lots of little options that you can play around with this thing. It's got a uh, hard drive in it. So if I miss that commercial from Cochran Toyota and how good of deals we have, I can go back and just rewind it and listen to it again. So if I wanna click this, go back to live, pop that out, which is a really nice little feature. It's a source, if I wanna to go to Bluetooth, it's gonna ask me, do you wanna pair? Hick yes. And then again, add, now I go to my cell phone, hook it up, it's just that easy. It's a really nice setup. If you haven't used these new Toyota um, setups, it's awesome. Go to home, click this guy right here. Let me click that one right there. Oh, it's a navigation system. It's hard to do while you're looking at a screen. So click this guy up here, go to home screen, and then again, I can change it to three panel. I like three panel because you get a little more phone information. You can adjust. I can click that and adjust what I want it to look like. We'll go back and look what the three screen looks like. One of the nice options right here is this will turn in, once I got my phone synced and get my, my data in there, this will turn into a, a little cross with four of my favorite contacts. So I just hit one button, don't have to say anything, it will call that person as well. So awesome touch right there. You do have a nice backup camera in this guy. So if I look, it gives me six inches back from the bumper and almost bumper tip to bumper tip. So I can really see clearly back there. Uh, but again, at the end of the day, awesome looking little truck. Um, you've got your, your garage door openers right there. And then again, the Limited has the leather stitch all the way through. Inside here, you have your owner's manual, some hitch and wiring stuff right there for you if you need some more in there. Lockable storage. But again, overall, really sweet vehicle. Toyota certified. And again, just super clean for the year and the kilometers on this guy. Uh, I don't think you're going to find one in better shape um, around this age. Anyways, you want to come down and take a peek at it? It's like Cochrane Toyota.